for today's video, I'm gonna be setting up my at-home movie theater. So I am currently in my bedroom and I don't have a TV in this room. I personally don't think I need a TV in my room because I don't watch cable and plus there's like no room in here to put it because I put a bunch of stuff on the wall. Go check out my room decor videos. But I have seen a couple of YouTubers use little mini projectors to screen Netflix movies on the wall. So I thought it'd be cool if, if I could project it onto the ceiling. So today I'm gonna be reviewing the LED projector that I found on Amazon. I hope you guys enjoy this video and make sure to give it a like and let's get on to opening it. I think this was the first one to come up on the interweb, so I wanted to test it out. I don't know what any of this means, so this is gonna come from somebody who doesn't know anything about technology and is kind of just wanting to project her Netflix movies. So this is the projector. I think it's very aesthetically pleasing because of the yellow and white tone. And this is just what it is in the box. In comparison to my hand, this is how big it is. Sorry, my hands are looking a little rough. It's very cute and looks very mobile, so let's open it up. Oh, and this is just eyebrow pencil, sorry. <laughs> so opening it up, we have styrofoam in here, so I'm just gonna slip it out like this. Now onto the reveal, baby. Oh, it's upside down. Yay, OMG, this is so cute. As you can see, it comes in this little styrofoam box with two sections. So this one, I'm thinking, are the cords and a remote, that's so cute. And then this is the projector. Oh my gosh, it's so small. It's so small, this is so cute. OMG, I love this. So in comparison to my hand, this is how big it is. It is so tiny. I can literally like, that is so cute. I'm gonna go set it up by my bed and let's see how it works. So it's a little bit later and I realized that I needed command hooks, so I got two. They're the five pound ones, hopefully they hold up like the screen. I thought I would be able to just put the projector towards the ceiling and then it project on the ceiling. My way of explaining it was very messy, but essentially pointing my projector at the ceiling wasn't going to work for many reasons. So I decided to use a bed sheet as my screen and I needed a way to hold them up, which would be with the command hooks. Continuing. So I will show you how I'm going to do that. What I realized is that the command hooks will not hold the hanger. The hanger would slip off. So I decided to clip them on with these binder clips and it worked. So. My arms are too short. So my thinking for putting these hangers on were that I can just fold them into the hanger as you can see with this great demonstration that I have of pants hangers. You just slip the pants or in this case the bed sheet into the two clips and then it just tightens at the top and I thought this would work very well for an at-home movie theater. I'm gonna get my laptop right now to see if I can connect it. This is so fun. I'm back and I have my Mac. Let me tell you how long this process took. I didn't realize that an HDMI cord was different from the hard drive cord that I have. And it took me forever to realize. It was just a whole ordeal. So enjoy this clip of me freaking out. In reality, this took four hours of me freaking out to finally ask my dad for help. really cute 
you. I'm going to try to turn off the light to see if it makes a difference. I think the quality is not the best, but it'll do because I got a home theater now. Let's check it out. the cutest thing I've done. I highly recommend you get this projector. It's not the best quality, but it'll do if you want something to watch on. I love this. This is very much a vibe. That sounds so gross. That was it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to give it a like if you do. If you want to see more content like this, then make sure to subscribe. I make videos every Sunday and Thursday. I hope you guys are having a good day or had a good day and peace.